<sighs> Thank you, Rawal, for joining us. <laughs> you got a little Mag fight song on Battlefield, but he's not even in this game. Oh wait, he has the fucking Kevin Falcon skin, where he uses his legs. <laughs> Uh, 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 Well, <sighs> let's get her done! Not really sure how this matchup goes, but it's very slow and endurance built fight. Even though Peach is lighter in the D and it'll take less hits, she can. D doesn't land. Like, he's too slow. Like, D shouldn't really be landing hits against Peach. But I guess she can play it, like, vice versa. With a uh, D throwing waddles, but I mean, the best bet is to hit with aerials. And oh, he just threw away a stitch. Shit! Oh, that fair could hit. He's living because he's so heavy. He got mad jumps. Nice back air. Stuffed it. Goddamn! Oh, what the? He just pushed him out of the stage, man. Leave Battlefield. Let's go to Yoshi's. Hmm. Okay, Nair. Wow. Okay, that was that was good link. Damn, Harry's just going hella aggro, man. Can't say nothing about Jed. He's trying to find Foden right now. He's off stage. Getting uh, getting rocked, but he's got the suck. Ooh, just gotten better at timing his hammer, man. I, I got duffed in the face too. Snipe? Nope. Ooh. Yep, that's dead. Ooh, damn. This, man, this match looks rough. Rough as nuts. I mean, D is just too slow to handle Peach in that in your face high priority area, man. He really needs to play distance and attack with like the longest reaching normals he has, like aerial wise. If he stays on the ground, you just gotta get rained on with heals, man. Oh, good up smash. Covered the platform high. <sighs> Typically, in Peach matchups, you want to force her to go low. Because getting off the ledge is one of Peach's worst, worst weaknesses. But Jack can make this back. I mean, it ain't no Smash 4 with Rage Mechanic, but... Oh, okay. Here he goes, 1 0. One, go! Okay. Second match, Smashfield. Oh, okay, see what I was talking about? Staying on the ground, the ZD. You're so big, and your shield depletes. You're gonna get easy shield stabs on DED on the ground with Peach's down air, like that. So you wanna like keep away, you know, do like small jumps, throw waddles. You don't wanna, you really can't fuck with Peach up close as D. All your moves are too slow. By the way, I don't play this game anymore, guys. So, like, I don't know. Maybe PM specialists want to complain. Fucking go ahead. But you know, this is 
These are just like common sense things. It's like, doesn't take much to see that D is gonna buy. Oh, I lied. He's not. Damn, that was a really good recovery. But I still, I still took a lot. He had to throw like so many waddles just to get that one Gordo. And see that moment where you just get down aired and a further pressure, like you can't really do anything besides like roll out of that situation. If you try to jump, you know, you might just get clipped by any other normal from Peach. But the good thing that Jed's doing is that he's taking every opportunity, every hit that he does just to add on a little more damage, like down throw and a forward tilt. He's doing a good job linking that almost every time. And he's getting a little too predictable with the fair off stage. Just gets hit by counter. Counter very uh underutilized, but you know, it's not that good. So you only use it if it's an absolute read, usually. <sighs> Hmm, okay. Yeah, I like the choice of Pummel, just because, you know, none of his throws are gonna kill, so you might as well attack on percentage. Oh no, that dare to up air. Okay, good roll, kill got grabbed, really, really bad. Oh no. Another problematic thing too is that when you block a DD's aerials on the ground, like, even if he L cancels it, there's so much lag. You can probably just wave dash out of shield and punish him. But, this, uh, even though I've been complaining about the matchup, <laughs> I don't even play D, I don't even play Peach, but Jed's, uh, doing very well. Trade and blows. Ooh, good forward air. Max range, as low as to the ground as possible. It's really good. Oh, but the turn up got in his way. He would have definitely got, you know, a good probably 10-15% off of the inhale and maybe get another 10 from a forward air. But yeah, yep, right there. Just dare or fair. Float cancel. Oh, good trade, man. Alright, brought the last sock. Oh no. Just get grinded on the ground. Ah, jeez, that's, that's broken, man. You just... I'm, I'm calling it right now. I'm. This matchup looks like 9-1 or 8-2. <laughs> this looks really bad. He's praying for a hammer right now, praying for a hit, and that should be game number two. Oh, he almost made it to the platform. Here he goes up. Two. Oh. <laughs> Got a soul search, man. We're gonna see Samus. And yes, he pulled it out. Let's see how this matchup goes. FD, comfort pick. Actually, this is a good pick either way. I mean, Samus has a decent ground game. Hey, Jed's doing a good job. He tacked on a lot of percentage right off the bat. Ooh, good conversions. And he switched to the ice mode at the beginning of the match. That's really smart. You want to hit her as hard as possible. See, Harry had to DI that up smash all the way out. Because if he didn't, he would go straight up and die off the top blast zone. Ooh, Jed, Jed's doing really good, man. Shooting missiles. And typically, like after missiles and charge shots, you'd expect them to just keep doing that. But he took the opportunity to see that they're still in their shield, waiting for more projectile spams or a, uh, an aggressive like tilt or jab approach that he just got free grab. It was really good up tilt to cover the umbrella. It was a trade, but it was a good trade. Jed's in the lead. He can actually. I think 
he should be able to take this on FD as long as he keeps this strong runaway game in gang strong percentage when he gets a grab Ooh. see all these grabs but he has to watch out for Peach floaties at early percentages I mean even for 80 that's still pretty early on a peach that you gotta make sure that you're hitting the characters with the strongest part of your hitbox oh my god damn Jed's on fuego man it's okay still stock lead shooting missiles I mean traditionally Peach is supposed to win this, right? <laughs> I have no idea. Eh, actually, mm, probably not this game. <laughs> I, oh no, that sucks. Grapple phase through the stage. I don't know what happened, man. Oh wait. <laughs> It's PM, I forgot. You're supposed to aim for the ledge. Because it's supposed to attach to the ledge. Not the middle of the stage. Oh my god, those are risky zares. He's doing it right next to the ledge. Because if you go in a special special fall after that, he could have seed, but still going. Crash canceled the dash attack. Crash canceling too good in this game, you gotta abuse it whenever you can. Forward air. Living. Oh no, he's. Oh my god, he got murked off stage, man. That's. That's hella rough. Ooh, grind. Ooh, that could have been it. He needs to work a little more for that last kill. And damn! Strong ass pressure. Missile. Missile charge shot of smash. Oh, the battle of down smashes. He's on the ledge. Good grab. Oh, good charge shot. Damn, just doing a great job with Samus, man. I think he should have pulled it out after the first game. Well, let's see how this ends. The last stock. Both are a uh, high percent. It could be higher since so the matchup. And Jed wins game three. Harry's counter hit. Escada. I Smashville. Uh, I don't know about this pick. I mean, the wider area you give. Samus to zone. She'll abuse it. Good up smash cash. Oh, <laughs> did try to go with aggro, chasing him up there with a, a B. Didn't get it, so he got 54 for his troubles. Right, break out of the grab. No crouch cancel. Oh, did he get ice mode? Is he in there? Yep. Very uh, Street Fighter S the way that they're playing this battle. It's very a lot of waiting, and then not necessarily. You're not really getting combos or anything or strings. Well, okay, well that was a string, but it's really relying on zoning with projectiles and getting those one or two strong hits. is not like a footsie neutral, and that should be dead. Up smash, too high ceiling. Oh wow, good anti-air up tilt. That was that was a great, great defensive option. Whoa! Oh jeez! Oh my God, he's eating a lot of percent. He's find a way to get back on stage. It's really rough. All right, gets back on grapple. Oh no. 
Ooh, this is a fight on the ledge. Uh, he escaped. Down air. It's too good, man. Ooh. Oh, man, that killed too. That was rough. I don't know, Jed's just trying to throw a lot of grabs, but Harry's catching on and avoiding them. I think he needs to back up a little bit, play footsies, and shoot more projectiles. But then again, I think maybe Harry picked the stage because the the moving platform may mess up his uh, missiles. I think it's a good idea to always have charge shot because oh, Peach is always taking a long time. Oh no, he could grab ledge or anything. Ooh, counter. That was a very late counter. Charge that beam. Alright, two stocks apiece. Jack can come back. He just not So the projectile war it's not what the other guy gets projectiles up. This is good spot dodge on the grab otherwise he'd be dead oh god <laughs> just just shielding like peach aerial float cancel it's very scary the mix up potential on the shield it's very rough you e like even for this matchup um, like peach like if you get upbeat out of shield which is something that just hasn't been really doing um like proper DI and good uh, wiggle out. Peach can definitely make that exchange off the up B, the defensive up B, to her favor with a good two hits or not. It's almost there. Oh, he's, he's playing too aggro, but that charge beam paid off. One stock to one stock. Oh, he went for a grab. Insane grab. He was floating in the air. You really got to try and condition your opponent to stay on the ground or in shield to get one of those kind of grabs. But right now, percentages are skewed in Harry's favor. Oh, nice. You're just tacking on any percent you can, but you dodge it into a forward tilt. Oh my god, that, this is very close. He just needs one or two more strong hits. Oh, he shot the wrong way. Forward throw, no kill. Oh, that that's it. And Harry wins 3-1 in a very close set. Alright, man. It'll be me and Harry.